Yo, what's going on guys? Blue here coming at you with another PGA 2K21 video. This is going to be my first ever course showcase video. Um, in these course showcase videos, I think the goal is really just to play courses that designers have put out um, that are asking for a little bit of feedback or just want it, you know, um, uh, reviewed so that you guys can see it so that maybe you can get some more plays. Um, my intentions for this is not to completely destroy uh, the work that someone's done. I will offer some critiques here and there, um, and I will I will point out all the good things that I've seen, um, and then we'll go through that uh, for every course that I do. The goal of this series is going to be one or two per week. I think I'm going to do them regardless of whether um, I've made the cut or not. So previously, I was going to replace the last two rounds if I didn't make my cut in TGC with two courses to play, but I think this might be popular enough. I might even double up videos on days, maybe have like a, a 2 p.m. Eastern release and then like a 7 p.m. Eastern release with a course playthrough. So I think two playthroughs a week um, for courses, as long as I keep getting recommendations and it's been pretty solid. We have this one. We'll have another one uh, coming up for you guys tomorrow. And then I already got two for next week. Um, and so it seems like it might be it might be rolling a little bit. So if you guys know of any courses that you've seen people play and you want me to play it, give it a little review or 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 uh, or overview or playthrough or or what have you. Um, it'll be my pleasure to do so. Leave a comment down below. Also, eighty like eighty or eighty five percent of you aren't subscribed to the channel that are watching the videos. So go ahead, subscribe. Make sure you put the notifications on so that you always get my uh, my content. Um, again. You know, we're doing at least one times a week's Apex content, uh, Apex Legends content. Um, we'll be doing some Mario Golf upcoming. We'll be doing the EA game. We'll continue to do PGA um, and all of that good stuff. If you haven't seen my CCA video that I put out yesterday, we did not make the cut, unfortunately. But uh, the big news is there is that I've completely moved away from keyboard. From keyboard. I've completely moved away from controller. And I am now uh, playing the game uh, entirely as a keyboard and mouse player. Um, so. Although I would love to give this course my best effort, um, I might I might struggle in some in some ways. I'm not going to take as many practice swings as I did in my CCA. I don't want this to be like an hour and a half video. Um, so there might be a lot of mishits here. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. But this is also great practice for me to get the rounds in. All right. So today's video, the links at Mendoza by Mister It's Luxurious. I will put name of the course down in the description. I will also link this gentleman's Twitter you want to go give him a follow i think he does other courses um he's he's sent me some uh forewarning that the back tees are really are, are supposed to be really really hard um and that uh there's uh certain certain parameters you want me to play on uh so let's take a look at those right now and then get right into it the links at mendoza by it's luxurious let's get it All right, so here we are, the links at Mendoza by Mr. It's Luxurious. I, I guess he's doing this on a console. So this is a console-created uh, course. Um, I'm playing it on pins three with the back tees, medium winds, default wind direction, firm greens, firm fairways. This is made on a Highland-themed uh, course, so he, he, it's possible that the default, even though he sets them to firm or very firm, uh, the default might accidentally switch or glitch and switch over to soft so he's made sure that we want to play these on firm he, he asked me to do it on medium or high winds um and then i left it everything else at default green speed is fast i don't know what the green speed speed is going to be um it's a par 72 course 7617 yards so it seems like it's going to be a long course based off of the picture first of all i like the plot um it looks like there might be a lot of elevation so the 76 7600 i said 76000 the 7,600 yard course might be deceiving as a number uh, if a lot of it is going to be downhill. But if a lot of it's uphill, of course, we'll run into the same problem. So let's get started. I think I'm actually going to try and switch back to the long driver. I've been, I've been practicing my tempos and stuff, so I might switch back to my long driver. You'll notice I'm playing all long clubs now. I think they're more fun. And I think I can hit tempo better with keyboard and mouse. So. I'm going to be doing that. 
Also, I'm going to turn on the sounds that we don't normally get, the announcer um, and stuff like that. You guys let me know if, if you think that's if you think that's better. Uh, I, I just I find maybe there's not enough ambient music going on. Um, so I'll put like game music uh, back on and I'll put the commentary volume on. Uh, we'll put them at like 50. You guys let me know if you rather this or you rather just hear me talk. Um, we'll turn the ambient volume up a little bit, crowd volume up a little bit. And we'll do it like that. So you guys let me know if you want that on. I don't know if it'll work for this round, seeing as I started the round without it. But I think we'll do that from now on with the videos because I don't want to put any music or anything. So let's get to it. Uh, right off the bat, love this opening view. Love this 100 yards downhill shot. Already, you're 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 setting the stage for an elevation change type course. Um, it's going to be very clear that we'll have our work cut out for us when it comes to doing some math. We're not going to do all the math though. We're going to try and play this as quick as we can. Um, <clears throat> like I said, I'm not going to destroy the course at all. Um, so far, so good. What I see, um, I see maybe a few sculpting issues over here along the fairways, but it is a link style course. So it's not abnormal to see. I also think these are default T boxes. Um, so there's no, there's nothing there with the T boxes. Um, let's see the approach at the green. Uh, guys, I do a flyover for you, but I'm not gonna lie. Um, I have no idea how to do it. I, I could do like the F11, F10 thing, but then I have like, I have like no idea. Oh well. There we go. So we'll get the plot. Oh cool. Okay, never mind. I actually do have an idea. So here's the plot of land. Um, I'm doing this as best I can here. So there's the plot of land. Um, designed on uh, Island Island, obviously. A little bit spread out as far as the as the routing goes, but it's still like you know nice nice and tight in some areas. Uh, uses the coastline here. We'll see how that plays out. Um, I guess this is the clubhouse. I'm not sure what this is, but I guess you end I'm trying to see here. This just seems like a hotel resort area. I'm not sure. Well, I guess we'll see what the routing is like. This is hole one over here. This might be hole 18. Or maybe this loops around and goes this way somewhere. We'll, 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 we'll check it out. Seems to have some stands throughout. Decent amount of planting. So we'll take a look at it. Alright. So let's kick it. Um, let's uh, just take a look at the, the, the greens. So far I love your greens. Um, connecting of the fairway to the green. That's something I would work on. I was you. Uh, just smoothing that out. I, li I, like, I like the green though. I like the way like. We'll see what the approach shot looks like, but this is kind of cool. Nothing drastic. Doesn't, like, kind of go against the grain. Very cool. Said I wouldn't do uh, many practice swings. I just want to do at least one just to try and get the tempo. I have been practicing. I have been practicing. I don't know. This one could go either way. Oh, got the announcer now. We're in the bunker. Careful of this one. Fairway bunker. Not sure what's going to happen here. Thank you, John. You guys let me know if you prefer having John or prefer not having John. I think it adds a little bit of something and at least, you know, it gives gives some sound to where we're, we're lacking a little bit. Um, this is going to be at least 118. So we need to go one club up. Ooh, fast is not going to help gonna leave us with a long putt again my goal here i'm not gonna do any practice swings and from that lie which was kind of a dirty lie not a bad result long putt left though all right if you can sink this snatch a birdie and be on our way we are gonna practice these i mean check for the power wow Came close. So this one's seven feet away. Looking pretty good. All right, par. Good job. 
All right, we'll move on to the next poll. Even par after the first. See what I'm looking at here is I'm looking at I'm looking at view. So right off the bat, I don't know what this is. We'll we'll take a look at it. It seems to just be. I don't think it's anything uh, particularly important. Seems to just be uh, hills. So right off the bat here, this I would probably lower by about five feet, six feet. Open up the view. Raise these a little bit. Seems to be just a little bit of sculpting here that that could be done along the sides, and then you you see your. I like the way this is framed. I like the way you see the hole at the end. I would have liked to have seen this row of sand traps up the up side left and right. Powerful swing. Wow. Guess I didn't even notice the wind. That's uh yeah. Be nice to have that one back. All right, we got right, wind this moment about here, and deep in the spinach. It's gonna be thirty six, so that's gonna come down to forty four. That's not gonna be <clears throat> Get up, Paul. I didn't take a look at the green. That's on me. Maybe get off the green. There we go. So well, you're gonna look um, at it. You're still in it, but you are hitting from a pretty gross lie. So don't let it get you. Down. Look at this green again. Connection of the fairway. I'll, I won't. I'll try not to repeat a lot of things. Um, bunker. Bunker could be. A little better sculpted so sculpting is definitely something that that uh, i'd like to see improve a little bit connecting of the fairways to your to your green as well your greens are very good i um so far your two greens i i, I like them a lot i like them immensely it follows the flow it's very natural look <clears throat> something i struggled with um when i started when I started designing was uh, keeping that natural look on greens. I always wanted to make like greens hard. And uh, well judged on that one. I always wanted to make the greens hard and unnecessary and they, and they ended up looking not natural in the setting. Um, right. Having breaks Staying that just even after that make no sense and all that stuff. Left to right on this one. <clears throat> so another blind tee shot. This blind tee shot wouldn't be so bad though. If I just didn't come off another blind tee shot. Because this blind tee shot, at least you see a little bit of the fairway here. Um, it could be done on purpose, you know, and then you have a... It opens up to this this look over here. Let's have a look at the green. Again, another really cool, very nice, you know, standard, standard green. Follows the flow. Doesn't look overly hard. Looks pretty natural. Your green, your green so far, your best feature. It's tidy. And we've got about 150 yards to the pin from here. Swing plane issue there. If not, I'm hitting perfect. Again, my right tempo, there, I, think. I have found a good tempo, and I'm way more consistent with keyboard and mouse well, luck than I was time. with controller. This is your third shot. Go in. Oh, imagine. Keep that one close. Well done. Imagine. All right. With the tap in. Up mm -hmm. Oh, I like this. This is kind of cool. This 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 whole view. You see kind of the other holes. I like this. I like this this so far. Very nice. I don't I don't know if this waste area is necessary. This is kind of weird that you've now gone to you had everything like closed up on fairways. And now you kind of put your fairway way open. And your waste area is over here when everything flows right to left like if anything, I'd be putting like a waste area over here, like this whole green fairway part. Maybe I'd have put it down here because everything kind of goes this way, right? It all flows that way type thing. That's just me. Um, 150 is going to add, say, 15 yards to the whole situation. So about that. That. All right. Beautiful swing. 
swing planes off and throwing things to the right. Okay. <clears throat> right was a good miss there. We'll be all right there. One under par if you can sink this. 20 foot of downhill, 20 feet is about there. I'm getting really, really good at just. Oh, this one could drop. Swing plane. Swing plane issue. Par putt coming up. But again, a very nice green, man. Your brakes are nice and natural. Very impressive greens so far. I'm very, very much liking it. Left to right. Again, we're, we're, we're into a blind situation, but this time, I think if you just take this away, you've opened up your view here. I don't know why this little bush is directly in the middle of my of my tee-off swing. Other than that, you know, really cool. This little split situation makes for cool design. Obviously, there's a little bit of work here to do with your spline points and stuff to rounding it out, making this look a little more natural, like this jagged straight left, straight left, straight left work on that a little bit but everything like concept wise you have very good vision and idea um i think it's just a matter of working with the with the with the course uh designer a little bit Ooh no we're losing it right leaking right now. although we have a we have a fairway to the right to save us so thank you for that design well, you might need a little very tight fairways very very uh, very, well very it does have that linksy feel Fairways are are tight. Off, off the rip. I don't know if I even make it. Ten yards is two fifty. I'm leaking everything right with my swing plane. This is gonna hit that edge and go way right. Okay, third shot. Setting up here for your fourth. Huh? I only hit it 95%. So there's a mistake. Should have been a birdie. Should have been a birdie here, but we're still on even par. Even par at the moment. Ooh, is this drivable? It's not drivable. It's not drivable. Very narrow again, but we're going to end up with a short... Short drive. I like the view. It makes it look closer than it actually is. I kind of like that trick of the eye. I like that. I like that a lot. This is another T over here. It looks... It, it does look kind of like artificially built up. Not that that's necessarily a bad thing. Can't place Damn. my finger on it. Something was off on that swing, though. A little bit slow. Are we gonna water. Yeah. Here's our second. We're saved. We're not in the water. Pole. Fourteen is gonna be twenty. Plus, try this one. Tempo is really good. Approaches and drive wise, I'm so happy I made this Good switch. One. I do have a lot of work on the one under if this goes in. I do have a lot of work um, to put in on the um, on the short game. I do have a lot of work to put in on the short game, which I understand why I really missed that. Well, that tempo. was uh, yeah, that was tough. Just wound up short. Right, um, well but done. I'm way more consistent than I was ever seventh. way uphill 64 yard 64 feet uphill like this this hump probably didn't need to be there maybe make it a little bit lower just to open it up and not make it so blind but I like that narrow landing area but it's a short it's a short par four so that's okay you know even if you end up hitting rough you're at least not completely penalized 
Yikes, this one's hooking. Wow. So there's your I faceted Quite an elevated green out there. You might need to uh, we still extra club. We still only have you know 150 in. Now, of course, it's 150 in plus 15 yards for the elevation. So we're looking at one, let's say 170 with the wind. And then I got to hit 170. I'm kind of, I'm hitting like a 205 club here. I like this hole. That's kind of cool where it's blind, but it shows the, the center of the green. It's a good touch. That's something you would, it's something that's believable. Light slow, but I think we flat. should be okay. Yeah. I was hoping that would go more left. But we're okay. That's we're safe. okay. So even with a mist up here with a very long putt. Even with a mist uh fairway, we're able to reach it. Which is nice. Trying to see, is it lower? Or is it more? Yeah, I'm having a hard time finding it. 50 feet, huh? 51% power. Overpower the shot just a bit. Ooh, close. Lining up for the 13 foot putt. It's getting there. Oh. <clears throat> okay, time to finish up. Fortunate bogey Let's there. The we drop one. Up. We drop one. Wind's blowing out there, right to left. Drop off to the left's cool. Now the pop bunker. In Fairway, we're gonna aim right. Oh, that was a fine swing. Fine swing. Good drive there. Take a look at the green on this one. Setting up about 180 yards out. Again, another cool green. This one's kind of the funk, one of the funkier ones you've done. But a nice, cool three-tiered green. It's a bit of a long shot in on the second shot. 180 yards. But you've given me a way to kind of like work my way to the to the hole, I think, which um, I accept. Definitely accept challenge. I want to go 180 yards. I want to go 192. Come back. I think I'm going to go 192 with a little bit of a bit of the English on it. Well, it's heading in the right direction. Still long. Still long. Nothing wrong with that. Safely on the green. With the firm green, maybe I take the shorter club and I roll it up. Forty-two feet. Probably somewhere in the forties. Hit it way short. Now that one could have used a bit more pace. Yeah. Three feet to go. Should have, I should have warmed. I should have done a warm up putt there to find the tempo. I'm not. I'm not ready yet to not. To not. On the next hole. Peeing off now and a long par four. Not ready yet to not practice swing on putts. Swing plane's an issue, like but again, tempo's really good. Fairway. And this one is around 180 yards to the pin. I'm going to hit this one 192. The wind's going to hold it back, but even if I hit this backboard, um, we're going to be fine. Perfect.
perfect. Solid approach there. Pin high. All right, this is for the pin bird. high. Oh my god, I, this putt's tracking. I meant to practice swing. I swear to god, I meant to practice swing. But we birdied. But I did mean to practice swing. I was like, it's gonna be around here somewhere, and I just took a quick, quick shot at it. So, when I get my swing plane right, I slow. When I get my swing plane wrong, I perfect. I just gotta figure out how to do the two together now. That's not gonna be good. <clears throat> Let's get out of Short. this. This Oops. is uh, a little spinachy for my liking. Short putt. Short putt. Short approach. Uh, this is gonna be 105. So for a 127 with it down, this might do actually, downhill. This could roll into the rough, uh, I, I think. I would have done, I would have. Setting up for our third Bob shot. Wedge. Oh, beauty chip. Birdie. Let's go. Nice chip in there. Don't get too cocky with that, though. Well, let's rewind and watch that again. See how this went down. I think it's more enjoyable with the announcer and a little bit well, of the music. There, that'll bring your score down to even par. Again, let me know what you guys think on that one. Part four for this one. Like this. Cool hole. Mountain mountain work could could use a little bit of work on how to develop mountains. Play with the tools. Play with some softened softening maybe even just like pick the highest peak put a flatten brush over it and just flatten it once and uh with the fuzzy brush and see what that gives you let me know if you guys want me to put out some tutorials for design I learned a lot i can put out uh sorry i don't know why i'm practice swinging it's just habit oh we did it perfect swing playing perfect oh, this tempo dropping fairway for sure Oh, he says fairway for sure. It's going on the rough, right? <laughs> that the rule of thumb. And this one's about 160. Oh, I hate that this is blind, man. I just hate that that's a blind shot. This whole section could have been dropped down a little bit and at least, you know, not not have been a blind shot there. You got a lot of blind shots. This is one of your this is another bit of a funky one. Again, very cool greens and your greens aren't like overly overly done when it comes to like breaks and stuff to make it hard you've kind of left it to the natural flow your greens are by far your best feature and now we got of course again now we're putting fairway around the thing it's almost as if like you started to do fairways a certain way and then might have seen a tutorial or played um played a course or something where you like this and then you say oh yeah i'm gonna start putting fairway around it kind of has like two different styles going on um, within the same course, which is not necessarily bad in and of itself. Um, just be careful how you utilize it, that's all. Oh, I'm not going to get... Oh, it won't get there, man. Oh, I wanted to God. get there. Nice approach. And this putt is way out there. Best of luck. 30 feet. Slightly overpowered, but I did bring the power back just in case. That's decent. Not not great, power. but it's decent. All right, eight feet to the cup. Overpowered it. Right I take multiple, I, even though I hit, this even though I hit the bogey. power on the first one. Is that what? You really get your it's idea with the second nicely. and the third practice swing, if you're actually over the in moment. the in the zone. All right, tee this one up and stick it on that green out there. Whoa. Okay, so now we have a 173 hole playing 163. Playing like 153 in the wind. Just a pure swing. 
little bit fast. So it, yeah, it's gonna be a little bit long. That would have been the club. My worry was that I wouldn't be able to hold the screen. Okay, I was able to hold the screen. My worry is those playing with forgiving clubs might not be able to hold a green like this. Go in. Go in. Oh. Uh, even that was a little long, huh? The only thing left to do is sink this putt and get your par. Ah, uh, swing plane issue. Putting's letting All me right, down. Nice Putting's letting me putt. down for sure. Oh, well, that's too bad. Second it's definitely the part I knew the most I was going to have to practice with this change. Hole. We got a tailwind to deal with. Wow. This thing here has got to go. This hole would be so cool if I could see all of this. Like, if I could see this view. So this here, unfortunate. It's okay that this tree, like, like this angle here is, is decent. You know, that the hole is tucked behind that tree over there. You don't necessarily see it. But this here, you got to think of a visual, you know what I mean? And this, this here just ruins the entire visual of this, uh, this hole for me. Otherwise, you know, it's a, it's a really well thought out hole along the coastline. You know, you got you got the other hole down there. That's a cool hole there too, but like it's unfortunate. Good thought process otherwise. Just a smidge slip. into the fairway, I think. Ooh, I didn't even realize really I didn't even realize it was it was that um hitable. This one's for birdie. So far so good. Oof. Okay, birdie putt drops. Two. Minimum two practice One swings. Over for the round. Minimum two practice swings, Blue. Stepping up to a par three here. Long par three. Can we roll it up there? I have to, right? See if this rolls up there. We'll never find out. So we too much to the right. A little like the par three green. Approach. I think it rolls up there. I liked it. I liked it a lot. Side bunker. Liked it a lot. It's uphill. Five percent of the bunker, so two. Go in. Woo! Nice shot from nice the splash. Stand. Wouldn't that be nice to save par on this one? That's a good par. I'll take nicely. that par. Good hole. Got a par four good hole. Oh, one. love this. Big fan here. Big fan. Very nice hole design. Very nice hole design. What are these for? Guess I'm about to find out. Very nice hole design. Take a look at the green. I like this green shape. It's kind of cool. Kind of funky. Again, very natural flow of a green. I really, really like it. Really, really like it. You got you got a real gift for greens. You got a real gift for greens. Oh, I got a case of the slows, man. Fortunate. Well, that won't do, will it? We really like to see what the and approach would have been luck here. With your second here on the fifteenth. Oh, do we get there? We're gonna get there. Oh, that's a really cool, ah, really well placed Setting protection there. For our third shot, I think we're going to splash this. 
Hot. Slightly fast. Okay, 19. Needed more. I was really on the uphill there. Took off to the right off my uh, right off my blade. Other bogey, unfortunate. Course is getting the best of me. Course is getting the best of me. Left to right here. I mean, I don't mind the blind hole once again. Just not sure if it's necessary. It's another blind hole. Like, I feel like seeing this entire... It's okay that that's tucked away over to the right over here. But imagine, like, seeing, like, all of this and then just out to the water instead of cutting, like, half, half off. I think this, this busts through, huh? Oh, I'm going to end up here and... Oh, this might roll out. Put a little bait. Yeah, you'll oh. take that. Let's give Very a powerful. Look at the green from oh, here look at this. Us. Nice bowl green. Very nicely done bowl green. And again, not overly exaggerated. Talented when it comes to the greens. If you're a designer, and, if you're a designer and you're looking to partner with somebody to... To do maybe you know maybe you struggle with greens hit up it's luxurious man All right on the green and he does really good greens in yeah, my opinion for eagle and that's fantastic here is your putt eagle putt for eagle Putt appears to be online. Oh. Oh, man. Just missed. Had the eagle. power, though, but almost had an eagle. Work out there today. That's your almost had an eagle. So far. Might be able to make a move here. This is a short par four. It's rough. See, this is what I was talking about before when it's clear, straight into the sun, and then plus this reflection on the water. It's rough. It's a cool look, though. It's definitely a cool look, though. So, this is a drivable par four. <clears throat> it's actually overdrivable. But like I look at it and I go, what's the worst that could happen? Is that I'm ended up end up over here in this in this in this rough. 320, I'm gonna hit 320. You know? Do one of these situations. Oh man, did you ever send that one? I guess that's the worst that could happen, but is that so bad, right? All right. Like, is that so bad? Shot here on the 17th. It's not an easy shot. Yeah, I see you. Wind playing at you there, but oh, we don't get there. Oh, I might be dead here. Well done. I think we're dead here, and now we're gonna have a super long, super long putt. With this putt. Super long. I I don't know if I'm if I'm even 
equipped for this. I don't think I hit it hard enough. Oh no, dude! We are in big trouble. We're actually further back. I could have used a little bit more power. Okay, there. well, we answered the question as to. Still didn't hit it hard enough. Oh, I'm in trouble. Ooh, never like the most short. About you got there. A dozen feet to the hole from here. This hole just destroyed me. I can't believe this is just for bogey. This one's on a good line. Get there. Oh no, double bogey. Wow. What an experience that was. And that'll Well, well, well trapped. Uh, okay, wind's picking up a bit. We got a head Again, just blind. Imagine being able to see this whole situation. All you gotta do is lower this, like. But but the hole, like right along the coast and everything, that's, it's such a good, good. It's like in your head, it's it's all there. Just a just a few things to like clean up on, man. Really nice course, though. And that really was nice a course. Wow, I can still hear the echo. I like this finishing hole so far. Seeing for a linksy course, I like with the green all around. That should have been consistent throughout the course. Time for our second shot here on number 18. Can we make it there? We can't. Definitely can't. Do we want to make it there? That's the question. This might be bad. Well, Okay, here's our third shot. Overthought it, overplayed it. And this one's your fourth. Here is a look at our Bravo, cuts. Bravo, Bravo, Bravo. Today you end your <clears throat> Plus three. Well Obviously, a lot of putting issues, but man, my and tempo when it, to, um, when it comes to approaches and when it comes to drives. And that'll be it for me here today. Thanks very, 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 very happy I made this I switch. Time out there. Hopefully, we'll see you again real soon. I'll let John stop talking. Very, very, very happy I made the switch over to the keyboard and mouse um it, i'm i'm enjoy i enjoyed the patch already even struggling with the co controller i enjoy it immensely now with with the mouse uh being able to just stay consistent on pc um really really cool really really cool um the links at mendoza mr it's luxurious i'll link everything down below for him go give him a follow go give it some plays let me know what you think um very well on your way. This is it's a great setup for a golf course. There's a few tweaks in there um, that would make it like just supreme, uh, but really, really good uh, designer, up and coming guy for sure. Um, a lot of great ideas in here. Don't ever hesitate to reach out. Um, you know, I could point you in the right direction when it comes to uh, design and all that. But um, there's a lot of people out there that have put videos out to help you um get better at that and uh there's there's a lot of potential here uh so very very good job very well worth the play very fun course 
um, to, to, to go through. So I suggest everybody go and play it. For now, I hope you guys enjoyed the first ever playthrough of, uh, of a course, a showcase. Um, tomorrow, we'll be giving you guys another showcase. Uh, it's going to be a course uh, by uh, Mr. Mayo. So you guys will get that video out. And then next week, we're doing a uh, Baby Bull double header, where uh, he's requested we play two of his courses that he made uh, polar opposite styles of on purpose. So um, we're going to do back-to-back -back day videos for Mr. Baby Bull, uh, who does a lot of really, really good stuff. Um, one of my favorite designers, for sure, and a gentleman that, that helped me out a lot. Uh, so if I can get you know the word out there and, and um, make a video for his course, and that helps him in any way, shape, or form, be happy to do it, because he extended the olive branch to me uh, when many uh, didn't want to. So I really appreciate that. Until next time, I'm Blue. And I'm out. Peace.